like mine. We come for you only go like once. What's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Tuto. If you're new here and to my returning subscriber, welcome back. Please do consider subscribing if you're new to my channel. Like and comment. So, I'm always out of breath. It's actually so annoying. But I just came back from washing my hair. He said I went to the gym. And what else did I do? I forgot what else I did yesterday. But today, I'm just gonna... I want to wash my wigs, but I don't know if I want to do it now. And then later on, we're going out for dinner with Trevor. I was just like, let me go and eat out. Let me go and eat out. Because chances of me being indoors the whole day are very high. And that's something that I actually don't have a problem doing. And it's actually very bad. So I was just like, let me go and eat out with my friend. So we'll do like a cute get ready together outfit, you know, everything. We're going to a new restaurant. So I'm really excited about that. Is there something in there? Anyway, I wanted to say if you guys, obviously you guys have noticed that I haven't been that consistent the past two months, Feb and March. And that's honestly because there's not really much happening, guys. And I looked back at my videos from last year and I was releasing like a video once a month, like one in Feb, one in March. And that was because of what is currently happening, like there's not really much going on. So hopefully things will pick up and I can be able to vlog and show you more things because I love vlogging and making videos for you guys. So. I honestly feel like I'm gonna end up changing these frames because I don't like how these lights look. That's not the point of why you get lights so that people can see them. No. Guys, I'm lazy to go upstairs and it's looking kind of crazy. This is how I am looking. I'm wearing these Kendra leggings. Legs top, Zara top, Fendi bag and Alexandra wearing shoes. I feel like I'll show you guys. <laughs> oh my gosh. I feel like I'll show you guys when I get back because like so hot babes. The lighting is not really on my side and I'm not going to take this camera downstairs because I'm already running late so you guys are going to have to do with this. At least if I show you guys when I get back. So I think we should do that. Hello. <laughs> you look so nice, friend. Happiness <laughs> jungle. Gonna change this chair. Look at what he's dressed in. Okay, period. 
guys i just got back home and i really tried to do like my outfit but you know when you're running late like things just don't be making sense but this is what i was wearing very cute and simple i didn't get any pictures because i don't want to take night pictures i just feel like it kind of throws off your feet so i'm avoiding doing that trevor is so shy did you guys see he was just like shy and awkward he's literally like me <laughs> that's how we friends like come on now and then now i'm just gonna take off my makeup and go to bed it's like nine o'clock there's nothing else to do and um yeah i'll check you guys tomorrow going for boxing if you guys see my wig like lifting here just mind your business because ain't no way that I'm gonna make this wig so tight just to go to the gym no like I'm really annoyed that I have to wear a wig you know so I'm just gonna make my life more complicated but anyway we're gonna go work out with um Sfiso, and then after that we're gonna go see Sabrina to do my nails and then I need to return some stuff at Zara and um, Yeah, that's it. And then I'm gonna come home Shower and I'm gonna attempt to film because tomorrow I just filmed for like YouTube I mean yesterday I just filmed for YouTube So today I really want to film for my Instagram I feel like I've been so quiet on Instagram and it's actually not like intentional like it's really not but I really need to start putting in effort so please I hope I do the video today so yeah let's get going I'm trying to figure out because today I want to take pictures right I'm trying to figure out if I should do my last summer look or leave it for when I travel then I can wear that outfit or just do like sort of like winter looks because it is getting kind of cold already so I don't want to look crazy like posting like winter clothes when it's not even that cold already do you get what i'm saying so i'm trying to see in my closet the side oh my gosh where i put my winter stuff i have this beautiful fur coat that i got was it last year last year and maybe i should take pictures on it because i've never worn it i did unbox it with you guys so i really don't know maybe i should do two looks i used to hate winter guys because i never like bought winter clothes i just hated it but now i love it so i'm thinking maybe i should wear this for a coat it has like a little thing yeah it's a beautiful pink so maybe i should wear this with some leggings and some boots what do you guys think it's giving rich okay but i'll see so i'm just gonna help me take pictures because mandisa is busy today so check you guys um later on today when tabiso gets here and then he can sort of like help me even though he just likes agreeing with everything that i say but yeah check you guys later when he gets here that's a little bit of crime here and there why <laughs> there's something 
<laughs> hey y'all, it is like the next day and I'm wearing this outfit again. I shot this outfit during the week, but I just want to show you guys what I got from Zara. I really don't like shopping from Zara in South Africa because I feel like they are extorting us. They're literally extorting us because it is so expensive. I literally cannot. But anyway, the first item I got is this cardigan. It's sort of like, yeah, it is a cardigan jacket. It is very warm and I love it. I feel like it goes with my style so well. And I wear it with this black top and these pants from H&M. So, yeah, I love this cardigan. I want it in white. I want it in all colors. But yeah, this is how it looks like. And then, I got these pair of blue jeans. They are high rise, wide leg, and they fit so well on my body. I just love them. So yeah, this is how these pants look like. They're quite long as well. And because I'm always buying blue jeans, I had to stop myself from buying another pair of blue jeans in this style. But these are a mom fit. And this is how they look like. They're actually so tight on me. Like I was like, girl, are you sure about this? But yeah, this is like grey. very cute and then I got this top it is so soft can you guys see and it's just like halter short sleeve what am I standing there you'll see you can literally wear this with anything and I like such things it's like it's warm but like not too warm because in winter I don't like getting I don't, I don't like dressing up too much to a point where I start getting extremely hot like I don't like that so I just like to dress just enough and this top is perfect even if I wear it like this these pants I feel like it will still go you know pair of heels and handbag and I got this blanket type of jersey my friend Bouche loves these things and she always used to wear these things every time we go out for dinner like in winter as like friends she's one person that she's always wearing something a blanket a scarf a jacket because she's just always cold and i'm just like you're doing too much <laughs> but yeah when i saw this i'm like i have to get this i'm literally obsessed with it let me show you guys how it looks like it is so bougie they are these amiri oh no boots that I want to get but I haven't ordered them yet I feel like they'll go so well with this do you guys see it's just a blanket with high heels baby like baby with maybe leggings okay I can't wait to wear this out like it just gives bougie like with a handbag babe somebody invite me out for dinner in winter though <laughs> now it's awesome but yeah this is how it looks like oh i absolutely love this little blanket i don't know whatever you call it but it's eating babe also fabric always giving i don't know why people like complaining about zara quality but i don't think it is that bad it literally isn't to me it is fine so yeah those are all the items that i got from Zara there's also another dress that I saw online that I ordered but it's gonna come with some of my, the stuff that my mom ordered so I'll show you guys when it gets here and yeah that's all next time I'm buying stuff from Zara it's it's for for summer which is gonna be soon but I'll, I'll tell you guys about that but anyway that is all for this try and haul morning dolls today is a sunday and i am going to church i haven't been to church the last time i vlogged can you imagine crazy but today we are going to church 
So, well, let's get ready for church. Guys, you know sometimes when I'm just sitting by myself, I always have so many things that I feel like I'm gonna tell you guys. And then when I get on camera, it's just like I'm blank. Like I literally forgot everything that I wanted to say to you guys, which is kind of crazy and annoying actually. But anyway, I came across this um, TikTok video during the week um, that I want to share with you guys. Um, I'll put a screen so you can see which one I'm... Please don't mind that. Actually, let me take it away. So basically in the video, um, it's a girl talking about social media and instant gratification. And I love that video so much because it's something that I always speak about to my friends as well. About how social media has normalized so many things that it's actually not normal. You know, like we often get so consumed by social media and what we see and what other people have that we tend to forget that life is actually very very long that is something that i am learning like every year i learn that with age comes certain things comes money comes certain things that you can attain you know so i just feel like what we see on social media we'll see people having the latest bags um jewelry like i always see those things and i'm like mm, i want that i want that and then i quickly have to remind myself that i'm actually still very young like i'm 27 and i already have so many things like when i get to like 32 30 like obviously that means that i'm gonna have more things so i just loved the message behind uh, um that video because well, social media can be very crazy and I'm someone that also I struggle with like having to like remind myself because I'm such a shopaholic I really need to constantly remind myself like relax you'll eventually have these things like <laughs> the world is not coming to an end and I realized that with certain things that I've wanted like for a long time like maybe like jewelry or like a certain bag like once i have it i hardly ever use it and it's like i'm moving on to the next big purchase and it's just like it's a cycle that's never gonna end so i just feel like we just sometimes need to be content with some of the things that we have and understand that things come with age Obviously, like if you're younger and you're watching this, you might agree, but you might not really get it that way. I know when I was younger, I was focused on other things. It was always school, going out with my friends. Like, I didn't imagine my life to turn out the way that it has turned out now, which is like really crazy. And I always say to you guys that now that i'm older i really enjoy being older like i really love it you just become wiser you stay indoors more you just want things that bring you peace you just want to elevate yourself and work harder when you're younger you don't really care you say those things but you don't really like implement it but, but when you get older you start to like really stand on your word you know like i'm constantly always wanting to be like a better person a better version of myself you know so <laughs> basically i just love being older <laughs> that's all that there is to it like i can't wait to be like in my 30s because also like when you get older guys you just get more prettier <laughs> like you just become more beautiful because obviously you start taking care of yourself you understand that you need to like really take care of yourself because you get older therefore you need to preserve your body and look after your health and certain things like that so yeah guys <laughs> i really recommend getting older <laughs> when i was younger i used to like not want to be older because i was just like oh my gosh i'm gonna get old and then i'm gonna die and then like no one is gonna want me like type of vibe when i'm older but it's just like raw like I always tell you guys like being 21 and 20 and all those ages they're just very dusty like no one can pay me <laughs> to ever want to go back to that age like no one like no uh, 
there's just a lot going on or maybe my like early 20s were just very hectic but i don't wish to go back to that i'm just very happy and content with what i have right now and the way that i am living it makes sense for me it brings me joy i am at peace i might not have everything but you know like i'm happy do you get what i'm saying like that's all that's all that i can say to you I think also the problem with social media is that we tend to compare ourselves to other people. You see someone doing very well, probably your age or younger, and you're just like, why is that not happening for me? And I feel like that is wrong to try and compare yourself to someone that you see online, because in life we all have a different path my life is not gonna turn out the way your life is gonna turn out so it will be crazy for you to try and make a comparison you know i just feel like it's something that sometimes we tend to forget also the reason why i've just been saving a lot obviously i plan on traveling soon but it's just like once you start saving and I know I always tell you guys about saving but I really do mean it if you're able to save just a bit of your salary please do it like please do it this is why sometimes I don't be having deep chats with you guys because I tend to forget what I wanted to talk about Oh yes, and maybe some people might argue that you do find like maybe people that are older and still like go out and do things that you probably think that they shouldn't be doing and it's just a thing of like you create the type of life that you want for yourself. I don't know why the spray is like this. I put it on this L'Oreal setting spray. Because my Charlotte Tilbury one is almost finished. Wait, I'm done with my makeup. My wig is downstairs. So we're gonna head downstairs, get dressed, and get going. Fit for church. Hope y'all can see me, okay? I don't know if I was wearing this thing last week, but I love wearing these headbands when I'm wearing this wig because I don't have to glue it on. I literally just have to put it on, and I'm good to go. And I'm wearing this cardigan from Zara, Zara, Woolies, and my Valentino bag, and my Saint Laurent shoes. So yeah, I love this outfit so much because like this, ah, <laughs> this blue goes with this blue. So I'm literally obsessed. Anyway, let's go to church, yeah. Oh, I forgot to put on a necklace. Anyway, let me go put on necklace. My camera looks so dusty, it was just me. But anyway, church is finished. I'm trying to figure out if if I should go and eat at Tabs' car wash because they usually have like really nice food on Sunday and Mahodi on Mondays. So I don't know if I should go and eat there or go home. But it's only like 12 o'clock. <laughs> What am I gonna do with myself? Like, I can't think of anyone that can go out with me to eat right now. And I don't wanna go with KG. Not in the mood to be with niggas. Bandisa's not around. Dumi lives in Cape Town now. So, like, 
who can I go with? And I'm only gonna see Tanda during the week. It's sad, it's sad out here, babes. But yeah, I'll figure out what I do because I know soon I'll be hungry. And it's not even time yet because they start bringing out the food at 12. So I don't, I don't even know. But I'll figure it out. Don't worry. This is the food. <gasps> Can you guys see this? Like, look at the meat. So juicy. The chicken is just ugh. Perfect Sunday course. I'm gonna eat this. And end of this vlog, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Okay. And yeah, love y'all so much. I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs>